Uh, welcome, guys. We're here with Jeffrey Christians of Global, and also uh, we've got Marwin, who's uh, stayed on from the, the previous episode. Uh, Jeffrey, hi. Welcome to the show. Uh, can we ask you first of all, how did you get into football? Uh, for, for everyone who uh, wants to know you. Yeah, when I was young, I was playing on the street and the school, and yeah, in my home I play also football, but. My neighbor told told my parents, yeah, uh, your son is really good in football. He mm. loves it. But my parents, they are not so sure, and they don't like it before in football because <laughs> they are scared I break my legs or something. Right. And and I did a tryout in a club. And yeah, my parents, they 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 saw that I was happy, and I loved the football. And after that, I play every day football. Then. After my first club, I was there like two months, mm -hmm. and then I go to the second division in Belgium. Well, that's quite a leap. Yeah, and then after that, I go directly to the first division also, and I play nine years for the first division in Belgium. Well, that's that's really impressive yeah. uh, to go straight with Turnhout, right? What? With Turnhout, yeah, the yeah, Belgian club. Yeah. Uh, how was it there? What was the your experiences like with the the Belgian top division? How how does it compare to Philippine football? Yeah, the level is higher in Belgium, but uh, because it's not the same football like mm. Asia. Yeah, and there is a lot of other players, but it's also in the Philippines. Uh, the football here now is gonna be better and better. Mm. The level is gonna be higher and higher. And, yeah. It's okay. And throwing it across to Bert, uh, do you have any questions first? Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I think someone's lost in uh, Jeffrey there for a moment. No, I was admiring his tattoos. Like, sure. how many do you have? You should show it to the camera. I have six tattoos. One so. here, one here, What's here, the meaning? here. What does it say? Uh, this is an angel. Yeah. This is one uh, for my parents because uh, it's the born date of my parents. They keep safe of my parents. Mm -hmm. And this one is also for my parents that uh, yeah, it means uh, I thank God what my parents do for me, my for my uh, take care of me, mm -hmm. for, for everything. Yeah, this one is because I believe a lot in God. Okay. Because He helped me everywhere. So you have a rosary. Yeah. And this one, it's Tagalog, and it means yeah, work hard for your dreams. Because Let it be known that he has kapag may chaga may nalaga tattooed on his forearm. <laughs> Go! 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 That is awesome. When Do you know, have you tried the the dish called nalaga? Yeah. Here? Do you have it? No. No, no I think... No, you should try it. You should try it. It's, okay. a, it's a soup. It's a, it's a yeah. meal all to itself. <laughs> and I noticed you guys all have... Um, yeah. Your rosaries yeah. and your... Are you all Marian devotees in Global? Or at least the three of you in the under 22? I don't know. No. Do you I think it's more the European boys. The European <laughs> boys like, like uh, their bracelets. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how long um, have you stayed here to play football? I'm here now one month. But now I go back for three weeks to Belgium. Mm -hmm. And after that uh, I stay, I don't know for how long. You'll be back here? Yeah, I'll be back. Okay, with Global also? Yeah, for Global. Okay, so what are your future plans in terms of football? Hmm. Or in life in general? You're all um, 21. Yeah. So any, <clears throat> like, obviously you're, you're professional football players. What about um, five-year plans? Like, do you plan on uh, staying with football or... Um, yeah, I want to play only football. Okay. Football I wanna be, forever. Uh, I want to be a, a, a first 11 of the men's team. Okay, that's a very good goal. And you're playing as a striker? More left wing. More left wing, okay. Yeah. And some have compared you to Chiefy in that role. Mm -hmm. You have yeah. uh, particularly look quite sharp. I think it was a long 10 cup yeah, you were playing in. Uh, and you look very good on the left wing there. Yeah. How did you get into that position? Uh, was you Were you naturally left footed as a, as a child growing up? Or how did you become a left winger? Uh, before... I was a striker, but if I was young, I go always to the wing. Okay. And they saw I was fast and yeah. I like to dribble. And that's why they put me on the wing. And I like it also. It's yeah, my favorite position because I love to... I'm not, I'm not the man who, who scores always, but more mm -hmm. the man who gives the last, the last ball mm -hmm. that they, can, sco that they yeah. can score. And now it's your turn to ask <laughs> questions. <laughs> any, any question. Uh, uh, what should we know about 
No. Jeffy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I was gonna ask, uh, how did you find Philippines? Because I know it was your first time when we met in the Bacolod, so... Uh, uh, yeah, it was always a dream for me uh, for come back to the Philippines because my mother is from here and she never been here like 18 years. Mm -hmm. It's a long time. And my first day here I was yeah, like, this is not the same like Europe, it's different. But I was very happy. And then I did the tryout, but I don't know what's uh, the level here from the Philippines. And my first practice, uh, I did well. And coach-wise, they, they, they told me, yeah, you can play with the men's team also now. Mm -hmm. And I was so happy then. So why did you choose good. to represent the Philippines? Obviously, you're playing at a high level in Belgium. So why did you decide the Philippines over Belgium? Because now, uh, my last year, I play third division in Belgium. Mm. But they don't pay there, not so good. Ah. And that's the reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's the truth. It's the truth. Fair enough, fair yeah. enough. Welcome. And do you have any personal insights for us, Marwin, of, of, of Jeffrey? Obviously, How would you, you describe him together. as a friend? Oh, yeah. He's a good friend. I think uh, we've, been, we've been together for one year, but I mean, uh, it was one year. Uh, we, we've been in, the, in the Indonesia for the SEA Games and uh, also for, for under 22 and also for the uh, men's national team. So, uh, yeah, we have had fun together yeah. always because we, we stay in the same in the same house. So yeah. Yeah. <laughs> play FIFA together. We play FIFA together. So everything. everything we. Who's the best at FIFA then? Would it be you, your brother, or Jeffrey? <laughs> I was better. I mean. <laughs> 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 the last minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I think it's a, um, it's a good boy, good friend, and I hope continue to to. Stay in the in the Philippines, of course, mm. and for play together like in, in under 22, even in national men's national team. So I hope, hopefully. Mm. Will you definitely be joining Global? And what's the rumors regarding your your transfer status uh, coming from Belgium? Are you looking to join the UFL? Yeah, um, I want to. Yeah, now I want to stay like my whole life here in the Philippines. Wow. Yeah. It's and I want only go to yeah. I want only go <laughs> yeah. back to Belgium only for vacation. Roy, Roy, he's with global. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just a new transfer. It's because it was before. Oh, and <laughs> that's that's really, that's really great. And uh, and your time with the the under 22s as well. You guys have spent a lot of time together. Do you, how how do you see the next? Uh, I guess the the next years growing up in the in the Philippines more. Um, what what are you most looking forward to over the next few years? What would be the biggest football highlight, do you think, uh, for, for you guys in the, in the next few years looking at? I, I think uh, um, uh, what uh, Jeffrey said, I mean, the Philippines and the player, they, mm. is, uh, like in the, in the UFL, there's a new player and new stronger player, so the, the UFL is coming higher, higher level. Mm. But in, even in the national team, we have uh, we have uh, a lot of players, good, player, good player, really good because like Phil, James, and all I think all players in the national men's mm. national they are good. So I think uh, uh, I hope also in the like two or three four years uh, the Philippines maybe be one of the biggest uh, team in the Asia. I hope hopefully because uh, yeah. we are doing well. So I hope we continue like that, like this, even in the. Nepal tournament in the uh, yeah. AFC. Mm -hmm. We had a third place, but we can we can keep the first or the second. So I think uh, we're doing well. And lastly, to get a bit more uh, personal, as we did with Marvin yeah. and, and Marvin, uh, <laughs> do, you, do you currently have a girlfriend? I have a girlfriend. <laughs> ah, okay. I have a girlfriend I in Belgium like two years and nine months now. Wow, a long time. Long time. Message, yeah. for yeah. Message for your girlfriend. <laughs> Baby, I miss you so much, but I'm coming back soon. Can you also? It's his girlfriend! No, 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 it's his girlfriend. Oh yeah, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> to your girlfriend, you can. Uh, no, I miss her and I love her. I love her so much. <laughs> Just to clarify, is that that's your girlfriend or Jeff? <laughs> no, 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 well, thanks very much for more information on um, uh, Jeffrey Christians on the Anglers Brothers, on Jeffrey's girlfriend and what's going on in that situation. Follow us at FTW Sports. <laughs>